Now we are reading for the sign of uh, Gemini for the next, uh, let's take 15 days. Okay, so what can Gemini possibly expect in their love life soulmate connection? So what's coming up for Gemini for the next, let's take few days. What's coming up for Gemini for the next few days? Right now with Queen of Wands and the Lovers card, that is your card, the Lovers uh, and Queen of Wands, I see you being open to relationships, okay? If prior to this you are wanting to keep yourself closed off and not really wanting to, you know, date out and uh, not really stay open to dating and stay open to relationships and, you know, then uh, I, I feel you are going to be uh, feeling your vibe again, your mojo again, your, you, you will be open to dating very soon, okay, if you are not yet. Okay, I see you uh, f yeah, like feeling you yourself all over again, you know, like if if you had a phase where you uh, felt like, you know, you were not in the right uh, state of mind of dating and, you know, being open to relationship, then I see you being open to that now. Okay, so possibly let's see what else is coming up for Gemini people for the next 15 days. For some of you, there is a fire sign possibly trying to return back in your life. Doesn't have to be a fire sign, but someone who you are passionate about. Okay, I again see Ace of Swords and uh, Queen of Wands for you. So something tells me that you will get communication very soon. Okay, I see uh, you guys uh, cutting off any BS that that you were holding on to prior to this. Okay, if you were holding on to a relationship or person that was a player and things were not going anywhere, then I see you cutting that uh, out from your life and staying open to new connections. Okay, so let's start. So what's the overall energy going to be like between Gemini and their soulmate? What's the overall energy going to be like between Gemini and their soulmate? One card, what's the overall energy going to be like between Gemini and their soulmate? Ten of Pentacles. After a, a big ending in your life i see a new beginnings coming in stability is definitely coming in okay with ten of swords someone had hurt you bad in the past okay and with ten of pentacles i see someone who you consider a soulmate like the soulmate wanting stability with you you both wanting to get together and wanting something committed wanting something long term wanting something stable okay um, so in terms of your soulmate's energy what's the energy going to be like towards you what's the energy going to be like towards you Your person is definitely open to the connection now uh, with a uh with page of swords i definitely see this person uh, watching you from a distance okay they are very much open bottom card is the lovers card so they are very much open to this connection all over again they are open to communication and they are open to the connection okay for some of you you are dealing with someone who could have been a little younger to you and who was uh, who was not really uh, you know someone who uh, could make their mind based on if they wanted the connection or did not want the connection they were extremely extremely restless on you okay so how are they possibly going to come forward towards gemini you now one card for her. Uh, the Gemini segment, how are they possibly going to come forward towards Gemini now? With Five of Swords, this person is still trying to, you know, play their own sorts of mind games, trying to get a reaction from you maybe, or, or trying to see if you are up for it, you know. Like, why are they possibly doing this? Like, like why is the Five of Swords possibly present here? This person does not like to lose. Like, okay, okay, I'll, I'll tell you that much. They could be slightly immature, someone who's younger to you, you know, they do not like to bend, compromise. They just do not like to lose. You know, it, it's the way of the highway kind of a thing going on. You know, you can't do, do that with a Gemini. You know, you just can't. Gemini won't take that shit from you. Uh, I feel the waiting phase is now over. This person wants to open up now. Okay, with Five of Swords, I see them trying to, you know, get your attention in, in, in weird ways. Okay, with Queen of Swords, I definitely see communication coming in for many of you. Okay, so like, like... Their yeah, intentions towards you now, Gemini Soulmate's intentions towards Gemini now. One card for Gemini Soulmate's intentions towards Gemini. Wait, one card for that, please. Uh, five of Swords uh, is a card that shows me that in your person, if prior to this was trying to behave like they did not want you, they are still wanting to play that game, you know, where they are pretending like they are fine without you when they are not, okay? They are clearly not fine without you. They are just putting up a show that they have, uh, you know, uh, given up on you when they have not. It's just a game, you
okay so right now with your intention they want to change things with you they want to make things better they want to change the times now okay uh, so how are they possibly going to come forward towards you i see they wanting to fix things with you so how are they possibly going to come forward like like what action are they possibly going to take towards you one card for what action is gemini so so much possibly wanting to take towards gemini now Emperor's card. They want balance now. Okay, they might be trying to show that you know they are fine without you and putting out out all all those uh, games you know to get your attention the wrong way obviously. But they want to fight for this now. They 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 want a uh, balance in the connection. They want to fix the connection. Okay. So what you can possibly expect in terms of action? What you can possibly expect in terms of action from your person now, Gemini? What you can possibly expect from your person now? One card for that. Ace of Swords. They will communicate. They fucking miss you with Five of Cups. Okay. Uh, they are not happy wherever they are. If they are in another connection, I do not see them happy. If they are alone, single, don't no matter what shit like shitty post they are posting on 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 Instagram, Facebook, trying to prove themselves. No, that shit is not happening. I with Five of Cups, I see them uh, in a very um, you know sad place. Okay. In terms of where this is moving forward, in terms of where this is moving forward for Gemini and their soulmate. In terms of where this is moving forward for Gemini and their soulmate, one card for that, please, sir. One card for where this is moving forward for Gemini and their soulmate. I see you both communicating. Okay, you both are going to speak about the past heartbreak that you guys have had. If the person broke your heart or they hurt you in any any which way, you guys are going to communicate on that. I see you guys discussing that topic very very hardly. Okay, with seven of cups, you guys are wanting to clear the confusion now. Okay, in terms of their feelings towards you, one card for their feelings towards you, one card for Gemini soulmate's feelings towards Gemini now. Uh, page of Pentacles. They are wanting your attention with Six of Swords and Page of Pentacles. This person very much wants to be around you. They very much want your attention, and they are very much wanting and eager to start the connection. Okay. Uh, they no matter what they are trying to prove to you, I still see them wanting you on a very serious note. Okay. With Page of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles, the very start of it, I feel. This person is very eager to start this connection with you. Okay, in terms of how do they possibly feel for you when they miss you or when you know uh, they're thinking about you? One card for that, please. Ace of Cups. They know that you are the one for them. Okay, uh, they love you crazy. Okay, so one card for uh, like. What are they possibly wanting from you? One card for what are they possibly wanting from you? One card for what are they possibly wanting from you, Gemini's? What is this person possibly wanting from you now? This person wants commitment from you. They are wanting a strong commitment, and uh, what action are they wanting you to take? They want you to take that leap of faith, or they want you uh, to take that risk. Uh, in order to get back with them, okay. In terms of their love messages for you, we'll check that out for you. One minute, okay. For, prior to that, let's see what uh, a Gemini feels for their soulmate. If you are a cross watcher, I love you too, okay. So, in terms of that, what uh, like Gemini possibly feels for their soulmate, their truth, honest feelings for their soulmate, Gemini. Right now, with three of pentacles, Gemini wants to take things slowly. Right now, they are very defensive. They are not sure what the other person or uh, their partner is wanting with them. Uh, they might be having trust issues as as well. So, so they are wanting to take things one step at a time. Okay? They are wanting this partnership, but they are wanting it slowly. They want things to move in slowly. Okay. So, their intentions towards you now. One card for their intentions towards you now. Gemini's intentions towards their soulmates moving forward. Gemini's intentions towards their soulmates moving forward. they feel stuck to you okay uh, one thing is they feel stuck to you they cannot let you go of their mind okay gemini's and nine of wands did uh, gemini's 
do not want their soulmate to give up on them okay they are wanting their uh, their soulmate to stay stuck to them okay that's the truth okay so let's see love messages by gemini soulmates to gemini now one card for your soulmates messages for gemini love messages i've personally made them so let's see what what they have to say I never want to stop making memories with you. I never want to stop making memories with you. That's what the soulmate saying. Spirit, give me one more message for that. I'm sorry for being this hard to love. Okay, I'm sorry for being this hard to love. Okay, so that's what your soulmate is wanting to say to you. So this was your reading for Gemini and their soulmate. Please do hit the like button if this has resonated. Please support your channel by subscribing, commenting, and please keep coming back for regular readings. Thank you so much. Love you guys. Cheers.